to the residence of 108 Pembroke Road. As you approach your first winter at this address, a warning, written now for you as for those before. I've done this only to silence my old and stirring mind. Should you find yourself awakened from some pleasant dream when all is quiet by a rapping at your door, and you begin to smell an awful and acrid odor, do nothing else but answer the door. They have no dark designs for you, but ignoring them would be unwise, for they have come every year for decades and will continue to do so as long as these houses remain. Follow these instructions to the letter if you wish to survive their intrusions. First, remain silent throughout. Do not interrupt them. Do not ask questions. They are deaf to your words and will punish you for ignoring theirs. Second, bring a coat and some coal to the door with you. It is a winter's night. The wind is sharp and the air unkind to those unprepared. Third, if you are able, remain undisturbed by what you see. Dismiss the horror of their scorched flesh and peeling muscle their singed clothing and the smell of sulfur and rot. Once kind, if they detect your disgust, they will not hesitate to harm you as they have others. These boys, five in total, are untethered. They exist outside our understanding of space and time, brought to a terrible end when caught inside a workhouse fire. They linger amongst us in repeating cycles stuck within their days before. Each winter, they spend their time caroling, singing for coal to keep the workhouses warm. Upon opening the door, you will feel the heat of that same fire. You must endure it. At first, they will remain as silent as their graves. Wait until they decide to sing. You will feel, as they voice each excruciating word from their shard and rotted throats, in urge to tear at your own ears to escape that unpleasant chorus. I urge you to resist. Endure. Should they stop their songs, present them with the coal, for that is why they're here. It will smoke and burn within their grasp. Give coal to each and speak only to thank them for their performance. If they're pleased with you, if you remain kind, they'll vanish from your doorway in a cloud of smoke. Should they continue, listen with care, as these words are for you alone. Through song, they will share with you your future. Clues of approaching tragedies, horrific fates. Listen, learn, prevent these occurrences. Many ignore these letters and meet with sorrows large and numerous. I implore you, learn and heed, listen and survive. Appease these poor souls and they will appear to you but once a year. There is no avoiding them. They will come. Bury your fear or prepare to bury someone else. Don't repeat my mistakes. There are many long nights ahead. I wish you luck. <coughs> ah!